So today I'm in my Airbnb here in Tokyo. I'm actually hours, I'm not in Tokyo. I'm one hour train ride away from Tokyo and I'm about to meet up with this model and we're gonna be going to this really cool location. I've seen it all over Instagram and it's pretty much, the way I would describe it is, it's like an arcade. It is made to look like an abandoned area. So you're gonna get a good shot, 100%, even if you just go, even if you're not a photographer. Whew. Damn, it's actually really hot in here. I'm gonna open this window. All right, so I know there's a couple shots that I wanna get. One for sure is this shot here, which is the entrance, I believe, to the actual area. And then the other shot that I wanna get is this second one here, which is like a neon sign. I'm not sure where it is. I'm gonna try and find it. It shouldn't be too hard to find. But yeah, I'm meeting up with the model in like an hour, so, and it takes an hour to get there, so I should probably leave now. Let's go. I'm here with Priya, who's the model for tonight. We're here, I think I think this is it. This looks like it. If it's not here, it's not gonna be anywhere else. Let's go in and see what it looks like. Ah, oh, this is sick. What? This is, oh, that's the spot. I think that's the spot. I think this is the first spot that I was talking about where I wanted to get those neon signs. I thought it was gonna be hard to find. It's actually just right in the entrance. Here, I'll show you. And I wanna shoot them. Might get Priya to stand at the bottom of them or something. Not sure of the exact shot that I wanna get, but I know that I wanted to be standing like underneath them so we can get the red lights that are reflecting off her face. This fucking lift. We've been trying to shoot at this location and every time we've tried to get a shot, this lift here has decided to open. There's no one even, no one even came out of this one. We've got to press it every time it comes down so it goes back up so we can get the right shot. We'll keep trying though, hopefully we can get it. So we just finished up shooting at this sign over here. This is just the outside bit up, but I'm pretty sure right through here is where we need to go to get this shot, which is like the main shot that you get here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just through here. Yes, that, that looks like it, but I don't think it is. Maybe we have to shoot from the other side or something, because we got people here yeah. taking a photo. I mean, I'm in the way of these guys' photo. I'm gonna get out of their photo. Just like, in their photo. <laughs> All right, those guys are still going. We're gonna wait for them, and then we're gonna go get that photo. Did you get the photo? Okay, sorry. That's okay. So the shot that I want is, I want Priya to be standing in that sort of little orange circle at the end. It's like the classic shot that everyone gets here, but it's really cool, and I wanna try and get that. Just a nice sort of even symmetrical shot. That was a really, really cool place. And like, like it really genuinely looked like an abandoned sort of warehouse, like an old street sort of thing. Like, and it looked really realistic in real life. That was a lot of reels. It was surprisingly easy to find those spots. The first spot here, which is these sort of red neon lights, they look really cool. I like how they're in, I think they're in Jap Japanese, I'm assuming, I don't know. It's just cool seeing neon signs that aren't in English. It gives it a bit more character, I think. The thing that I liked about this spot was the redness of it. It just has that really like sort of danger vibe to it like the red really pops and then the main shot which is the thumbnail of this video is this sort of like green watery sort of i don't even know what it is it's like the back entrance to this arcade and once again the colors are what i really like about this spot how it's got the contrast between the two different colors we've got the orange which sort of changes it's like the orangey reddy color and then you have the green bluey color of the rest of the spot it's just it's just a really cool spot in general and if you ever come to japan i would highly recommend you go there like you have to go there i did have to put my iso up a bit for these shots just so that they weren't too dark which did compromise it because i had to have a bit of grain in the images but 
because I'm shooting on a Sony, it sort of handles that low light pretty well. And then as we were leaving this sort of arcade area, we saw this one last shot that I really wanted to take. And I didn't vlog it, unfortunately, but here it is. It's probably my favorite photo of the shoot. The thing that I like about it is that Pre is standing there, which gives the image a sense of scale. So you can see how big the neon sign really is because you can compare it to a person. But other than that, we just headed home and that was the end of the shoot. So that brings us to the end of today's video. If you've made it this far, let me know in the comments below. I'll check out that comment. As always, stay inspired, keep creating, and I'll see you in the next one.